What's up guys, this is Dim, and today I want to show you how to update your restock queue in TradeSkill Master. Alright, so I have a bunch of glyphs that I learned through the daily quest, but I have not added them into my restock queue. So I want to show you how I go ahead and do that sort of thing. So the first thing you want to do is we're going to go into groups in Trade School Master by typing slash TSM. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead into the operations tab. What I want to focus on is I want to focus on the crafting part, which I have a special operation for, which when I go to view operation, the minimum restock quantity means it has to be down to one and it will restock it up to two as long as the minimum profit is 30 gold. Okay, so I'm going to go into my profession I'm going to go into TSM groups and I'm going to just for the sake of this video do inscription and I'm going to go ahead and select the inscription crafts restock selected group. Now this will show all the things I need to restock based on that criteria of glyphs that I already learned and added to the group. But now I have new glyphs that I've learned through the daily quest so how do I add that? What I do is I go to TSM slash TSM go to crafting sort by inscription, sort by profit, because profit is good. Now under operation name, it'll show you either if it's covered under inscription, it'll say so. If it is not, it'll have dash dash dash. So from there, what I simply do is I look for the ones that are dashed. And as long as they're over my 30 gold profit margin, I go ahead and click to create two of them. So I'm going to go ahead and go through and click all the new glyphs that I've learned and I do this once every couple days so you're gonna see a few glyphs here that are not on the list you can do this every day and stay on top of this of course but eh, I like to spend minimal time on my crafting to be perfectly honest with you I like to get in and get out and do things in bulk so uh, let's see we're at uh, 18 gold profit which is actually below our um, threshold but I want for 18 gold it's still worthwhile for me to cra uh, craft at least once so uh, that'll do it. The, I added the ones to the restock queue. Uh, or I added them to the crafting queue, I should say. So what I'm going to go ahead and do, as you can see here, I have a whole bunch of Inca Dreams. So we're going to go ahead and gather for inscription. Close this out. Okay, so I just head over to the inscription supply vendor. And we're going to buy the vendor items. Sometimes this does act a little wonky. So you may need to click it a couple of times. So, like for example, this is saying I need some more Jade Fire ink. So I'll just click it again and buy that. Now for Nether Pigment, let's see what it's trying to sell me. What ink is Nether Pigment? Oh, okay, Ethereal ink. So we need to, uh, six Ethereal ink. I don't want to be bothered. I have so many ink of dreams that I'm just going to buy the ink, even if it's a little cheaper. Uh, I got the ink for plenty cheap, so I'm not going to be greedy. Now I'm going to go ahead and speed this up and craft all the ones that are on this craft queue. And when we're done, I'm going to show you how to add them over to uh, the restock queue to make sure that it's fully automated from there on out. Alright, so all of my glyphs are created. I'm going to mail off the last set that are in the group. And as you see here, there's actually five glyphs that are laying back around. That means those are the five glyphs that are not part of the group. And we need to add them to make them fully part of our automated routine. So, slash TSM, groups. I'm going to go to my inscription crafts group. Items. And this will show you the items that you have in your backpack. So I'm going to shift click all the glyphs and add them. There you go. Now those five glyphs are now part of our automated restock, mailing, and auctioning groups just by doing that. So if I hit mail select the groups, that's it. That's how, listen guys, that's how you stay on top of your new inscription glyphs and make a part of a restock queue. And when you go through it, make sure you have, you're gonna have, an, you need an auction group and a crafting group to make sure that you stay on top of your stock because as stuff sells, you wanna be able to replenish it and you want an auction group to make it, well, easy to post and cancel. All right, guys, this has been Dim. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.